Sanchez, you saying China is supporting Iran, but have you seen the new China Saudi talks about Iran? They literally declare three big islands of Iran belonging to UAE. China legit betrayed the regime, did they? I know about China's cutting the deal with Saudi Arabia as well, right? Huge, huge, huge. But I think China is just playing both sides. China, China is doing a perfect game when it comes to neutrality to a certain degree. They're saying, "Look, man, you guys, you guys sort out your own disputes. You guys sort out your own disputes, okay? We want to make a deal with both of you." And by the way, Sanchez, in my personal opinion, House of Saud is in deep shit. House of Saud is trying to break away from the U.S. petrodollar, okay, and it's trying to pivot towards Russia and China. They made huge moves. So is Turkey, right? House of Saud is forgetting its roots. House of Saud is only there because the British Empire in the United States supported them into getting control of Saudi Arabia. I think House of Saud is about to go the way of the Shah of Iran. That's that's a long shot, right? But to a certain degree, that's what I see. Okay, there's a lot of discontent in Saudi Arabia right now, right? In that whole region, right? So in my personal opinion, the House of Saud is playing a very dangerous game. I'm, I'm assuming Mohammed bin Salman, MBS, has, uh, has done the mathematics. And he's brutal, by the way, <laughs> horrendous, right? And I'm assuming he's done the mathematics. He's assuming that he can pivot away from the UK and the West and the United States. That's what he's assuming. Okay. Will Israel, the United States, MI6 allow the House of Saud to betray them? I don't think they're going to allow it. I don't think they're going to allow it. Okay. Anti social sphere. Is Israel has agents in whatever country working to destabilize is probably the most repeated phrase of the last 50 years. Elder God, a stone throw at the right time is better than gold given at the wrong time haha ha, persian proverb very nice saying and persians have amazing amazing proverbs some of the most amazing sayings ever like one of the simplest one is mastio rusty right mastio rusty set uh, states that uh, drunkenness is truthfulness thank you very much for the follow gil new so drunkenness is truthfulness that's what that saying is and in large part, it's true. One of the things that people associate with why the Shah was overthrown, I couldn't find this interview. Uh, I looked for it for the last couple of days, but it was an interview that the Shah gave, right? Uh, when he was a little intoxicated and he spoke a little bit too truthfully. And that was the catalyst that convinced the West to support the overthrow of the Shah. Okay. It is what it is. Hong Hong to the followers. Salute gang.